pro form. This is what I personally own in my house. A little bit goes a long way. If you're somebody that, you know, says, okay, maybe I made a New Year's resolution. I haven't quite kept it. Maybe I was going to do something and I ended up not doing it. Maybe you said I'm going to walk around the neighborhood, but then it's hot, it's cold, it's raining. I want you to consider getting this bike. First of all, it's a customer pick with 1,746 reviews on hsn.com. That, over a thousand perfect five-star reviews. Why does everybody love this bike? It's the bike that you will get on. The seat is comfy. I pull it in front of the TV set and I watch HSN or I'll watch, you know, my favorite shows that are streaming on Netflix or, and I have a little timer that I do. It comes, has, by the way, on board, it's got a little timer and I do 30 minutes and I do it almost everything almost every single day. So Melanie Douglas is our special guest. This is our first show Hi, together. I know, I'm so, so happy to be here. You're a certified personal trainer and yes. a uh, registered dietitian as well. Yes. So and you're everything. Yep, and I teach group fitness. I teach cycling at the gym. Okay. I have four kids. Four kids? And I, I kind of <laughs> have four jobs, but like one for each kid, you know? No, yes, I'm just kidding. No, but it's I have one kid and yes. that's a lot of jobs. Yeah. <laughs> so how old, what are the ages of your kids? They're 18, 17, 14, and four. Oh, I have one 19 year old. Oh, oh man, wow, how, yeah. I already respect the four kids. But this is Henry who has how many grandchildren? Oh, and one on the way, so soon to be 11. All right, so that's pretty impressive. Well, I just, you know, I've just been doing a jewelry show, popped on some sneakers, and this is what I do in my house, is I've got a little, uh, my little sneakers sit on the floor right next to it. And uh -huh. no matter what I'm wearing, I'll just pop on the sneakers, I'll get on the bike, and I'll do my 30 minutes. I do 30 minutes a day, and while I'm on it, I do the weights. They come in different colors, the bike. So basically, you're ordering the bike by the color of the weights. We've got blue, gray, plum, red, pink, and teal. And, and, and for how many in the pink? Oh, okay, so we have we have plenty in all of them. There's 500 in pink, but I think that's more limited, but, Okay, so it's the most limited as a pink. I guess pink is very popular. And there's also like a little kind of racing stripe on the side. They all look pretty much white, but they've got like a little kind of detail. Because Melanie has the blue, the blue weights, and then you can see on the side, it's a little bit of the blue. The seat is adjustable. I'd love yes. for you to give everybody a tour of this X-Bike. All right, let me give you the tour. So this is a fabulous product. This is the coolest bike I have ever seen and been on. I want everyone I know to have it, and here is why. So first of all, you, I'm just gonna start at the top. So first of all, you have EKG heart rate monitoring right here in the handlebar. So I bend forward, I can track my heart rate. I'm pedaling kind of fast, but you know what? You can take it slow, you can go moderate, you can watch Netflix. It comes with DVDs, you can really <coughs> come to my end. So you've got your heart rate tracking right here. You've got this console that is so easy to use. It will track your distance, your time, your calories that you burn, your pulse, um, your speed, and it can scan through it. This is positive reinforcement right here. It's always, it's telling you, look, you just did five miles. Look, you did five minutes. And the other great thing about this, guess what? You don't need a username. You don't need a password. It, there's no technology, there's no plug. You just get on and you start riding and you've got positive reinforcement with that. So then we have hand weights. They're built, you, they fit right here, nice and easy. When you pick up the weights, you can do biceps, you can work your shoulders, you can get your triceps, you can even get your core or do some kickboxing. I mean boxing, not kickboxing. <laughs> But you can use those weights so you get your strength training and your cardio conditioning all in one awesome workout. So then you also have eight different levels of resistance. So every time you hear a click here, I'm increasing the resistance. You've got eight levels and every time you take that up, you're increasing your calorie burn and you're also changing the focus of the workout so it becomes more of a strength workout for your lower body and for your core. So I'm gonna take that right back down. That resistance is really cool. Then you have this amazing seat. The seat is a game changer. That's why this bike works so well because you have the space to sit on the seat and be super, super comfy. So I told you I teach studio cycling at the gym. That, that bike seat is like this wide, right? But look, I can go one, two, 
three, almost four hands going across. It's really comfortable. So you've got some cushion. So that's a big part of why this product works. If it, if you mm. don't want to sit on it, you're not going to work out. So that's really great. And then you have this seat that actually adjusts. So this is great as a trainer, as a mom, this is for everyone in the household. You can take it up. There's actually six different height adjustments here. So high for the tall people in the family, for the kids, for the mom, whatever. These pedals are really great because mm -hmm. they have a safety strap so that when you're riding, even when you mentioned you just slip on whatever shoes, if it's your gym shoes, your slippers, whatever, yeah. you've got this strap so you feel safe and secure. What's the weight capacity? The weight capacity is 250 pounds. Mm -hmm. And then when you're done, it folds up. So this bike is a fold away bike. It's space saves. Look at the space that that takes up when you're done. The other great thing about that is not only is it tiny, it's also easy to move. So I can pick it up, I can put it in the closet. Mm -hmm. um, as a mom, I changed my workout location. So I do it for survival reasons to hide from my children, but I also do it for <laughs> do reasons. Do they start talking to you and annoying yeah, you? I'm like, no, or they're hungry. mommy needs to go hide. <laughs> yeah. But no, it's also really great to keep you motivated and excited about your workout, right? So one day you might go out and ride on the deck, watch the sunrise. The next day, go in the living room, watch some TV. The next day, put it in your bedroom so that you remember to do it before you get in bed, mm -hmm. bed or before you, right when you wake up in the morning. But you can change your workout location. You think about, I've worked with Proform for over 25 years. I've been on treadmills, I've been on bikes, so many different pieces of equipment. Mm -hmm. And I love this because I don't wanna look at the same wall every day. I don't wanna go down in my basement and look at the same boring thing. I love the fact that I can change my workout location. That's so powerful. Well, to me, my favorite thing about this is it's quiet. And that too. <laughs> because if you've got like some, well, if you've got a new baby and you make a noise yep. and the baby wakes up or you've got somebody watching TV and you're like, oh, I'm gonna get on my bike. It's like, oh, that's gonna annoy everybody. I mean, this is the, one of the quietest piece of fitness equipment I've ever seen. By the way, if you guys own this, if you're one of the, you know, 1,700 people that took the time to write a review on hsn.com, give us a call during the show. Our toll-free testimony line is one 866 Three seven six eight two five five. Um, but we're going to start out with a testimony from from Rachel, and she's going to tell you about her experience with the X bike. My name is Rachel. I have three kids. Before I used the X bike, I didn't really make a priority to work out like I should. I would go to the gym just whenever I felt like it. But it's really nice having the X bike at home so that if I don't make it to the gym, I can still work out when my kids are home. I am able to use the X bike. Wherever I need to in my house, I can take it upstairs and help my kids with their homework and still be able to work out. I take it downstairs, watch TV with my family, and I'm still able to be a part of them. You know, let me, I'll say, let's start with I'll, uh, uh, some of the questions. Okay. So I get this home, first of all, assembly. How hard or how easy is it? Because I will tell you, I got it home, put it together, I'm not gonna lie, my, my fiance helped me. Okay, I love to answer this question because I am not handy at all. Like I was like a Phillips screwdriver, what is that? Someone tell me what that is. So I got this for my mom because I told you I want everyone I know to have this bike. I got it for my mom. We put it together in the backyard, the two of us who are not handy in less than an hour. Yeah. Super easy. It's very easy to put yeah. together. And it's also really lightweight. And by the way, I'm gonna stop talking for a second and I want you to hear how quiet oh. it is. No, no, keep going. I thought you wanted to get on the bike. No, I was no, like, no. here you go. No, I want you to hear. It is so quiet. This bike is so quiet. Right. It is, I mean, it really, it really make that makes a big difference. And it really is very space saving it's, too. It's very space saving. So it's quiet, it's space saving, but it's also really sturdy. I mean, look, so I can even come up and do a standing, which you don't need to do, but I'm just showing mm. you that it's not wobbling side to side and it's still just as quiet. So if you think about all the reasons that you may or may not exercise right now, the things we, the excuses mm -hmm. or issues we have with exercise, this is small, doesn't take up a lot of space. This is quiet, it won't mm -hmm. disturb anyone around you. Right. This is efficient, you've got strength training and cardio training. This is not intimidating. I'm sitting on a bike, I'm comfortable, it feels good. And this is a workout that you can do on your terms. So it could be five minutes, could be 30, you could pop in the DVD, 
You could just ride while your, your coffee's brewing in the morning, but this is on your terms. So this no comes gym. with two DVDs, because when yes. I bought it, I didn't get DVDs with it. I'm just saying that I saw that we have the two DVDs that it comes with. Right. And the free weights are two pounds each, so it's a great way to get started. Um, what's on the DVD? What are we gonna, what can we expect to see when we get so, these home? Funny thing you ask, because I'm actually the trainer on the DVDs. Are you really? So. See, yep. obviously you I did not get the DVDs because <laughs> I never got to see it. And yeah. I've even said to them, can you sell the DVDs by themselves because I really want to see the DVDs. So, all right, I now know. I can just look at you I know. and we see got, what you're going to do. We need to make more. So, so the DVDs, they each have two workouts. So you've got two 20-minute workouts and two 10-minute workouts. So there's like a full body cardio burn. Oh. There's a 10-minute quick fit series. So the DVDs are really, really great in the fact that if you need someone to push you or to motivate you or to help you get through that 20 minutes because you're like, I can't do 20 minutes on my own, then you put the DVD in and it motivates you to get through that workout. The DVDs also help you learn how to use the hand weights. So you can learn how to properly work your shoulders and your biceps and triceps and kind of learn new ways to incorporate the weights into your workout. And they're really great. So people, I've heard from people that they do the DVDs regularly. They only work out with the DVDs. Right. Some people are like, I do the DVDs like once a month. It gives me new motivation, helps remember some, maybe some things I forgot. And so you can really mix it up. It's your workout on your terms. No pressure. No, like, you don't need to go to the gym. You don't need the perfect hair or <clears throat> shoes. You get to do this in your own home. And you know what? This is an activity that we all need. So I'm going to tell you. Yes. I get up in the morning. Sometimes I'm in my pajamas for quite a while. Uh -huh. Embarrassing, a long amount. I will get on this on my pajamas and put my sneakers on with my pajamas. I'm so well, glad to hear that. I mean, it is like, uh, people will come in and think yeah. I'm, I'm a crazy person, but I, it's my no. house. Yeah. And I, the whole idea of getting in the car and going to the gym and facing, you know, the 20 somethings at the front desk and then the, you know, the bodybuilders making all the, you know, grunting noises and I don't know what they're doing. And right. me like intimidated by all the crazy machines. I love this. And, you know, I'm obviously not, you know, a, a fitness model or anything. I'm just like a lady on TV. But as you get older, um, I'll be 57 this June. It's a little bit of movement. If you don't move it, you lose it. You yeah. got to keep moving, even if yes. it's just, you know, for your circulation. And when we talk about weight loss, I think a lot of people want to, you know, lose weight. I will tell you, if you're exercising, the real key is keeping it off. Right. Losing weight is easier than keeping it off for forever. Don't it's, you agree yes, with that? Yes, and so you have to think I mean, about you're an the activity. Expert. Yes, what's an activity that you're really going to stick with? That you're really going to stick and with, I agree. And that's why this agree. works, because riding a bike feels good. Right. It's comfortable. The seat's comfortable. We covered all those things that make this workout work. So this is something that you can really stick with. But, you know, being a dietitian and a trainer, it's really interesting because people assume I eat perfectly. Like, I only eat broccoli and chicken for dinner <laughs> but guess what i eat junk and cookies it it happens and we all do and it's you know how i do it i balance my choices with physical activity so mm -hmm. you think of this in your home as your balancing tool mm -hmm. this is your balancing act this is how you master that balance you have something in your home that lets you balance your choices you had a cookie no crisis mm -hmm. jump on your bike get some exercise get moving and you can balance those choices out because we have to move. I mean, think about over the years, um, mm. people always say, I'm so confused about health and fitness. Like, uh, eggs are good for me. No, they're bad for me. No, they're good for me. You know what I mean? I think they're good for you again. <laughs> they're back to good for you. I think they're you. back for you. I they're, think I read that. I think they're back to being good for you. But it can be, be confusing, wrong. right? When you think about supplements right. and diet and all this stuff. Like, are carbs know, bad or are they good? Are they're bad, bad, then they're good, then they're bad. Then it's not all carbs. Carbs it's some have carbs. been bad for all. I mean, <laughs> no, I love all foods. All foods fit, even yeah. treats. But no, the one thing that really hasn't changed is the fact that we need to exercise. So think about that. We've never we've never had a study that came out and said, oh yeah, actually exercise is bad for you. That's never happened. And think about all the different things that we struggle with. Mm -hmm. A lot of times people come back and they say, you know what helped me? Exercise. You let, let me ask yeah. you this. You're, you're where as a personal trainer, you've done yes. you, How much is it for one personal training session? So it totally depends on the area, but it can be 50 to 150 bucks, maybe right. 200. So that's one session. So one this session. bike is 139.95. Yeah. In the privacy of your own home, 
completely silent. You, by the way, you don't have to plug it in anywhere. You're not like, oh, I gotta find, it's near a plug, it's gotta be near a plug. You get on it. I get on my bike almost every single day. I get on it and I have like TV shows that I watch. I, I need yes. to be entertained while I'm exercising, I'm not gonna lie. I, I pull it right in front of the TV set. I do my 30 minutes, I do 30 minutes maybe six days a week about, and, and then yeah. I feel good. And I do supersets with the weights and the two pounds got light after a while. And yeah. so I did go out and get five pounds. Great. But I'm just saying that to start you off, yes. you know, a lot of people my age may say, oh, I'm gonna start working out again. I'm gonna do the workout I did in my 20s. Yeah. You can't start out that way, can you? No. You have to start, I mean, if you haven't moved in a while or you're just feeling like I am a total beginner, I don't know where to start. This is a fabulous starting point because you get to exercise sitting down. You might be sitting down right now. So we're just asking you to change your chair, right? So you get to exercise sitting down. It's not intimidating. There's no <coughs> fancy choreography. It's something that feels good. And it's something that grows with you. You know how I mentioned that there's the resistance? So look at this. So I'm riding right now. Here's my nice, easy pace, okay? This might be my beginner. This is my Netflix pace, mm -hmm. okay? This is my personal Netflix space. Okay, maybe the DVD's on, and now I'm pushing myself mm -hmm. for a few seconds, and it's helping me to grow, to push through that. Now maybe I wanna add some resistance. I mentioned that there were eight levels of resistance. Mm -hmm. Well, let me tell you what, an eight, I'm gonna put you on here in a minute. An eight, look at how I'm pedaling. I'm mm -hmm. really powering through. That almost feels like a completely different movement. And you know what? Even if you're a beginner and you go up to eight for 10 seconds, 10 seconds is better than none. I just changed my, challenged my body a little bit. But guess what? You can also back it up. So I can sit back, riding backwards. I do about half and half forwards and backwards. Yeah, it feels good because yeah. this really engages through your hamstring and your glute. It's just a different motion. Oh, there are so many positives. I'm just not even through my list yet. But guess what else is great about this? From a trainer, mom, I'm an aging body that I used to do high intensity aerobics and I can't do that anymore. It's not jarring my joints, right? It's so quiet, mm -hmm. it's so smooth. And this is not, there's no jumping, there's no grinding, I used grating. To, I, in the 80s, I yeah. used to go running. I lived in New York City and I would go running around. First of all, it was crazy to run outside in New York City in the 80s because yeah. I'd get murdered. But anyway, I would go running. I was young and I wasn't smart, Henry. I'm not gonna lie, I was not a very smart <laughs> person. But I, that's what, that was my exercise. And I, yeah. I could pound and now I think, I, I just can't like, that kind of pounding and on my joints, I don't think that that, because I'm trying to make the distance at this point. I'm right. trying to like be able to enjoy all the next 20, 30, 40 years. Like I wanna, I don't know if I'm gonna make it to 150, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, I love what you're saying too, because you know what? Exercise doesn't have to be painful. Exactly. So that, that's an old mindset, right? That yes. exercise has to be painful. Exercise should feel good and it totally can. This is, it's about finding the right product for you, which this, tends to be mm -hmm. the right product for a lot of people. I think this is one of the <laughs> most popular yes. pieces of fitness equipment that we've ever had here at the network. I will tell you that I talked um, two of the makeup artists, uh, Carmel and Kristen, both into buying this. Yes. Because they know I have it. Customers on Facebook asked me, what are you doing? What are you doing? Because they've seen my weight go up and down over the years. I've been here for 10 years. Uh -huh. And it's like, it, yes, I, it does get a little more difficult to lose weight when you're older. But yeah. you can't, I really think that if you don't have a regular piece of exercise equipment that's easy and convenient for you. In your home. In your home. Be, because, okay, maybe it's pouring out. Okay, I'm gonna skip today. Maybe it's freezing out. Okay, oh, I'm gonna skip today. Well, wh I don't, you know, I wanna, I wanna be by the phone just in case. I have my bike. I have my phone right here. I have it on the mantle. I, I can take a phone call. I got my TV, I'm watching TV. It's like I would be, instead of sitting on the couch watching TV, I sit on my X bike and that same 30 minutes is gonna go by whether I'm sitting on the bike or not. And you can do, you know, like, like you said, various types of difficulty. You can start out really, really easy, yep. warm shake up. Shake it up. Shake it up, cool down at the end. I mean, it's really, honestly, it's so easy. And you can do 10 minutes 
in the morning, 10 minutes at night. That's still 20 minutes. I've heard that yeah. that's the same as doing 20 minutes all together. Is know. that true? We used, yes. We used to say you had to work out for at least 30 minutes or it really didn't help. It didn't make a difference. Guess what? Anything you do counts. If you got up and did 10 jumping jacks right now, it would count. So a few minutes on your bike, every time you're moving your body, you're moving your muscles. So it's good for you to do that. But you know, think about this. We have staples in our home, right? Things that we need to be healthy or take care of our house. We have laundry soap, mm -hmm. we have salt and sugar in the pantry. Do you have something in your home, a staple, that gives you physical activity? Because that's part of the equation. That's part of the balance that you need access to I, I mean, at your fingertips or something, so you can get that physical activity because we don't get it anymore. We sit too much mm -hmm. and we can eat a day's worth of calories at a traffic light. Yeah. I mean, I've, I'm ashamed of it, but I've probably done that, wolfed down my entire day. And then, you know, we don't move enough. So you've gotta have something in your home that gives you the ability to just move your body. Well, lots of folks love, love, love the X-Bike. We're going to take a listen in and hear Debbie's experience, and then we'll be right back. I'm Debbie, and I'm retired. Before the X-Bike, I thought I was eating healthy. I thought I was getting some exercise, but I, nothing was happening. I went with my daughter, and we, we were dancing and playing around, and we'd dance for maybe two minutes, and I was going, I gotta sit down. I can't do this. I was out of breath. I did not f feel good. I chose the X-Bike because it, w it was something I could do on my own time, and I could do it around my own schedule and not have to worry about being at the gym at a certain time. Now that I've lost the weight, I can do more things. I can do the hiking. I can sustain my breath. I have friends all the time asking me, where, what are you doing? What is the program? And they're like, I want to know about it. I tell them I'm doing the X bike <laughs> and, and it's been awesome. Yeah. And you know, I really am shocked how little you need to do. I, you're in my mind, yeah. I was like, okay, I've got, if I'm not, you know, going out running and not doing weights at a gym four times, uh, you know, for two hours, I, you yeah. know, I, all I, do, uh, this is what I do. And if you're like just saying, I want to, I want to wear a sleeveless dress in the summer and I want to have my legs toned and I'm, I maybe I, I want to lose like a pound a week. That's healthy, right? A pound or two pounds a week. Isn't that the healthy thing? Yep. That you don't have to do that much. Right, you don't have to do that much. Most of us, we just have to move more and eat a little bit less. Right, exactly. Try to eat more plants. I mean, really basic stuff. It doesn't have to be a magic formula. It doesn't have to be torture. You don't need this crazy program that's intimidating and scary. It's just some, you just need something that lets you move in your home. You should try it. Let me, let me show a couple of, well, I, one thing I love yeah. about is that you can just jump on whatever you're wearing, right? right? And whatever you have on. Right. And, like I said, um, we we are about the same height. So the first thing that you would do if somebody new goes on it is you see what the you know what the height is to make sure it's comfortable. You're a little bit taller than me. I can feel it right now. So I'm going to make it a little bit a little bit lower. Okay. But and all you do is unscrew this. I know. Yes. And then I'm going to make it go down do you just like a little bit. Let me. Are you not trusting me to no, do this? No, oh, I I'm not don't. pulling out. Okay. <laughs> All right, fair enough. We'll lower you down one notch. You just have to line it up. Okay. Okay, but yeah, you do have these different adjustments here. So. Right, and it's important to be able to reach like the pedals and, and have it. You know, it's funny. I adjusted mine once when I got it. And yeah. obviously it's mine, yeah. so I never adjust it again. So but there, and there guess you go. what? Yeah. My no, husband is a software developer. He works at home. He has like four computer screens in front of him. Mm -hmm. And we got him an X-Bike. And he rides the X-Bike while he reviews code. At work, so he has a work at home desk. Right. My kids will be like, "Hey, I want to jump on the X bike." My mom has it. That's there is a reason why this product has over a thousand five star reviews. Let me tell you, in fitness, it's really hard to make equipment that people love. To give a five star review, that means you really like it. So, okay, so you're pumping some iron, you're doing some bicep curls, but let's kind of show some of the arm exercises you can do. So bring your arms up overhead, and you're going to do an overhead press like this. Well. I, will, I, I was gonna say, I was gonna show you what I would do. Is oh, what I do is a super me. is a set. That's exactly what I do is I do like 20 of these. Yes. And what I'm done, I do is I do an overhead press and yes. then I do about 20 of these and then I do my triceps. 
And then you could do triceps. Yes. So this is what you're talking about, right? Yeah, that's press. your overhead press. Yeah, and then, um, I, you know, I, I don't know how many X-Bike shows I've done over the years, how long ago we launched this. But it's, there, I mean, I, I'm a very beginner and I, I'm sure Melanie is gonna, you know, standing up and go, doing, you're doing like way more advanced things than I'm doing, but just, just the arm exercises. And I do yep. it at the beginning of the workout too. Because at the beginning of the workout, I've got like a little more energy. So I'll do the arm exercises at the very beginning. Yes. And then after I'm done with that, then I will crank it up and make it a little bit more difficult See, with the tension is I what I do. I love hearing this because you created this workout that works for you. And this wasn't intimidating, right? You, you don't feel like, am I doing the right thing? You just get on, it feels good. And you did, you, you've gotten results from it. So that's awesome. You didn't. But, but I just wanted to show everybody like that's, that's what I do. And honestly, um, my goal was not to be uh, a size zero and look like a different person that yeah. I was. It was just sort of to be the healthiest I can be and feel, feel great and have lots of energy. I mean, I have a demanding job, you know, and I work sometimes crazy hours. Here I am at 2 a.m. working out. This is, I, I tell people what, when, you know, they go, oh, you're going to work, what time are you going to work? Oh, tonight I'm going to work at 9 p.m. I'll get home around. But I guess 4 a.m. or something like that, you know? It's, and it's different yeah. every single day. Yeah. So it's definitely very challenging with the sleep schedule and all that. But ec exercise is really balanced out, like what you were talking about, balance. Yeah. You have, that's what you need. It, the way we live our lives with, we don't move our muscles enough, we have a lot of food, we have a lot of stress, we have crazy work schedules. And the way to get through that, to navigate that, is you have to have a workout, a way to move your body in your home. So it's something we all need, whether you're nine or you're 90, you've gotta be able to move. And the fact that just, you know, looking at, they're changing their workout location, right? It was just folded up in the closet, it's space saves, you can move it, go outside, ride. I actually know people who take it in their trailer, like when they go camping, because it's so small and it fits in their camper. Really? Yes, yeah, so there's all kinds of things. My mom uses it, she keeps it in the back bedroom so it's away from the grandkids, but the fact that you can change your location is super, super important because let me tell you what, as a trainer, I've heard all the excuses over the years of why you can't work out. You're bored, it's too hard, um, it's too noisy, I don't know what to do. This solves all those problems. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I think it does solve the excuse problem. And for me, I think that there's um, the kind of lack of embarrassment about exercising. I mean, there's no, there's nobody in the room judging you. Yeah. I mean, you even, you know, it's funny. I know you're a fitness professional and uh -huh. I have friends that are in that business and uh -huh. you think that people that, oh, they're perfect, they don't. I think sometimes people get into the business of it yeah. because they are striving to be, they never think that they're perfect enough. I mean, some of the, are, are the most self-critical people I know are the ones that are like the most perfect looking. Yeah. Yeah, and you know what? I, for me, I am all about balance. From the day I graduated with my degree and I walked out into the, into the world and wanted to change it, I have always been about balance. And that's why I love this product because that's really what it brings into your life is the ability to balance, to bring that balance with your food, with your fitness, with your stress, with a workout that fits in your schedule. And just like you were saying, I when I go to the gym, I feel like I've gotta have my hair done and my makeup done and my shoes need to match. Listen, literally at the gym the other day, I caught myself, I was matching my shirt, this shirt, to the bottom of my shoe, the bottom of my shoe color. I'm not wearing those shoes now, but I was like, I've gone too far. I've gone too far with the matching at the gym, but the, the, it's so great when I'm at home because there's right. no expectation, nobody cares. You just yeah. do it on your terms. Well, I think also maybe it's because I have a job where I'm in front of the camera and I think, oh, I gotta worry about yeah. this and that and everything. But when I get, you know, in my house, and this is, and I've done a lot of shows with a lot of different fitness equipment, and I'm not saying other things are bad, I'm just saying this is personally what I own and this is what I prefer because I like the low impact of the bike. I like how quiet it is and I like how portable it is. I kind of slide it around, push it, push it next to the TV set out of the way where the Christmas tree goes at Christmas time. It's a little spot. <laughs> Henry, don't laugh at me. That's where the Christmas tree goes. Everybody knows that, right next to the TV. And then, and then you know, I, I take it out. I, I like the evening news. I record it every day, so I'll watch a 30-minute news yeah. show. 
Unless I'm like obsessed with something on Netflix and I'll watch that. I get very obsessed with TV shows. And then, and the other thing is, I don't know if people are like that out there. Sometimes I'm watching TV and the hours go by. Yeah. You know, and, I, and I, I'm like, what am I doing? I'm Even, just sitting here for hours yeah. and hours. You, for those same hours, you can hop on the bike, right? Yes, yeah, so even if it was 10 minutes of those hours, yeah. that is improvement. If you're moving a little bit more than you did yesterday, if you're, okay, if you're starting from zero, you haven't done anything, you're a total mm -hmm. beginner, your goal, all your goal has to be is, I'm gonna move a little bit more than I did yesterday. It might be 30 seconds more, five minutes, mm -hmm. whatever, but you take <coughs> that goal and then you'll, you'll have those baby steps of accomplishment where you start to get stronger and more confident and as soon as you get more confident on the workout, feeling good about the workout, that's when you want to do it more. So this workout, this X-Bike is almost contagious in the fact that it's easy to, it's easy to do this type of activity and it feels good. So plus you've got all these easy tools, right? This console that's super, it's easy to read. There's no password, there's no app, there's no technology, no plug. It's just the basics, which is perfect. It's perfect that way. Yeah. You've got this seat that's oversized. It's so cushioned and soft. It makes it comfy, so you want to use it. It adjusts for height, so it can fit everyone in your household. I'm a mom. I manage a house. I want yeah, everyone in my house four to kids. have. Yeah. Like, I still can't stop thinking about that. That's a lot of kids. That's a, that's lot, a of lot of kids. Well, it's I'm a lot from of laundry U I'm from is what Utah. I'm thinking of. Oh, you're from Utah? I'm okay, from that explains Utah. Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes, right. we, we do have more kids So it's there. like a small family. That, I, it's actually small. <laughs> that's, that's, that's true. <laughs> but my four-year-old wants to ride the X-Bike, and I don't let him, but he's always like, Mom, I see you on the X-Bike. I want to get on it. And it, it's well, an activity Well, let's talk that, about that. Doesn't yeah. you think the mom sets an example for yes. everybody in the house? Like, if for mom, sure. If you're exercising... And maybe you want to have your, maybe you think your husband, gosh, maybe he needs to like move a little bit and everything. But we instead all do. Of, <laughs> right. But instead of <laughs> nagging somebody else to do it, if you do it, everybody will be like, well, when, when's it my turn to get on? Yeah. People will do, if it's in the house and they see you doing it every day, because I've noticed that as well, then they're like, oh, well, I'm going to go to the gym and I just, you know, did this and you know what I mean? It kind of right. creates... Just like, just like if you're, you know, all the other things we do as moms to try to set an example. Right. Well, you know what? On the mom thing or grandmother, because it's also for grandmothers, this is your multitasking machine. So I've had moms say, I don't work out because I feel guilty because I can't give, I can't take that much of my day for myself. And I'm like, okay, fine. That's, if that's what you're dealing with, then this is your multitasking machine. Do you need to schedule people to pick up kids from soccer? Do it while you're on the X-Bike. Mm -hmm. Do you need to catch up with your kids after school? Do it while you're on the X-Bike. Do they need help with their math? Do it while you're on the X-Bike. But you can so multitask. You can catch up on social media, watch a show with your kids. This is the machine where if you don't, if you don't feel like you have time for yourself, mm -hmm. then combine it with another activity. Then you will find the time. <laughs> Well, I, I just wanted to let you know what the offer is. So this is pretty incredible. So free shipping and handling, by the way. And I just launched the Today Special, and it was a pair of shoes, and we didn't have free shipping and handling on it. So it was more money to ship the Today Special. It's $5.50. This is free. So we're going to, we're zero excuses. We're going to, we're going to pay for it. And by the way, shipping is never free. Somebody pays for it. We're going to pay for it. Uh, and $27.99, that's your flex pay. $27.99. Now, there might be a gym in this country that, that's that low a monthly membership, but not, not a lot. So for about or less than the average gym membership, you're, we're, gonna send, we're gonna send you the bike. So you still have 30 days, you know, if you don't want it, then of course you can always send it back. But all you have to do is get on it for 10 minutes. Maybe the first week you only get on it 10 minutes a day. The next week, maybe 15 minutes. And then you notice like maybe your, your clothes are fitting better. And maybe you pick up the hand weights and do what Melanie's doing. And all of a sudden you're getting some of that muscle tone back and you're wearing tops like you've got like a... Um, uh, I've got like a little tank top under this. She's like, oh, you know what? I always wear a jacket. Maybe, maybe I don't have to wear a jacket. You know, maybe I can yeah. not wear a jacket anymore, and maybe I can just take take a jacket off and just have, you know, tank a tank, and as opposed to having. Um, you know, wear a jacket all the time and I can wear sleeveless, something sleeveless. And then, and then, you know, maybe instead of just, um, 
you know, uh, the pictures at the beach where you're hiding the background. Maybe you're like front and center. And then maybe you're not like dreading going shopping anymore. I mean, these changes come slowly. One thing after another, after another. They come slowly and they're big changes. Yeah. When, when you have that aha, that aha of like, you know what, I actually want to wear a tank top or I do want to be in front and center for that camera photo. Or I'm totally happy to walk on the beach in my swimsuit. Those are, those are some of the best things about fitness. And you know what, at that point, it doesn't even matter how you look. And that's the great thing about it. It's how you feel. And after you've been exercising for a while, you just start to feel mm -hmm. better overall. Like, I think Henry's gonna be on this bike through the entire hour. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. he doesn't say a word, and he's just like, the entire hour, Henry's going, uh, Henry, how old are you? Are we allowed to ask you that? 65. 65 years old. And I, I, I tell you my age every five minutes, but I really, is there an age like yes or no to this bike? No, there's no age. Every age, I, I adamantly believe as a trainer, as a dietitian, as a mom, that this is for everyone in your house. Everyone can use this. And you know what? It's beginner, athlete, mm -hmm. so I can do a beginner workout. I'm a beginner. I just sit on, I start riding. I say, I'm just going to start with five minutes a day. Right. If I have a kid who's an athlete, great. Add some resistance. I have eight clicks I can work with here. Right. If you take this slow or you really try and power through it, trust me, this is a challenging <laughs> it's workout. definitely hard. Each it, click is way harder yeah. than the last click. But it gives you room to grow. And it also gives you workout variety. So you might have a day where you just ride nice and easy, or you might have a day where you do intervals. So let me show you how an interval would go. Because people hear intervals, but they don't really realize how short they are. Uh -huh. So here I'm gonna do 10 seconds at eight. Henry, come with me. So look, we'll do eight. We just pumped it up. Now we're gonna try and sprint for eight, I mean for 10 seconds. So there's 10, nine, eight. Seven, I'm counting really fast. Six, five, four, three, two, one. <coughs> Great, back to one. Guess what? I just did an interval. And for a lot of beginners, you can do that. Mm -hmm. You can play around tell, with tell that resistance. Tell everybody why we want to do an interval. Why do we want to do that? Because we actually know that you start to burn more calories in a smaller amount of time. So it makes your workouts more efficient. Why? Because you're pushing yourself more than you normally would. And we need those little pushes. And that 10 seconds, your brain goes, okay, I can do this for 10 seconds, I will try. Whereas if I said, hey, why don't you pump it up to eight for 30 minutes? You'd be like, no way. <laughs> That's a hard no. No way. <laughs> <laughs> so it, it, it empowers you mentally and right. physically. Yeah, and you know, again, read the reviews on hsn.com. There's over 1,700 reviews that make this a customer pick. I think, Rob, I don't want to speak out of turn here, but I think it's our best reviewed fitness equipment that we've ever had here at the network. I mean, at least in the last 10 years that I've been here. And we've had a lot of, you know, things that have fantastic reviews on it. But so many people love this. We're going to take a listen and hear Rebecca's experience. My name is Rebecca, and I have five kids. Before using the X-Bike, um, I would try and go running and I didn't have the stamina that I was used to having in the past. So my goal was to increase my strength. It was also to lose weight. I chose the X-Bike because I did some research and saw that this one was very compact. It's not too heavy, you can carry it. I would carry it upstairs and take it outside and exercise with it. And it's it's quiet, like I have sat on it while we've watched a movie. Having children, you wanna keep up with them, especially as, as they become teenagers and just wanting to look good. And stamina is an important thing to me, just having that strength to be able to go out and run or hike or, or do those things that I like to do. That's really important to me. <sighs> All right, and you know, the, it. it you are getting color choices. So whichever color choice you get is the color of the free weights that you get. And these are two pounds. And you may say, oh, well, you know, what, what are two pounds? What is that gonna do? Tell, what can I do with two pounds? How, is that really gonna make a difference in what yes. my arms look like? Okay, first of all, it's gonna make a difference in, are you lifting any weight right now? No, if the answer is no, then anything you lift, two pounds is gonna make a difference. But here's why these work. Because it's about reps. So when you ride and use these two pound weights, you're gonna do lots and lots of reps because they're lighter. So I might do some punches or whatever I'm doing, I might do 100 reps. 
but you do high rep, low weight, and that's a great way for toning and working on that resistance training, and it doesn't matter what your age or your goal mm -hmm. is, but if you're moving your muscles and you've got some resistance, that is resistance training, and that's good for you. And you know what? I will say the older you get, the more important yes. it is to do resistance training because when you get older, do, does your uh, muscle tone get better naturally? No. <laughs> so as we age, we naturally lose muscle. So you have to fight for it. You gotta fight to keep your muscle. And I always say that cardio is like your short-term investment. Right. So I get on, I do some cardio, I'm gonna burn some calories right now. That's your short-term investment. But guess what, when I start doing these weights, weight training is your long-term investment. Right. That's what's gonna change your body over time. You put in the time with your weights, that's where you really start to see changes in your overall strength and muscle tone and calorie burn. Yeah, I mean, it, it really, do, and, and again, I, a, a two pound weight, it's gonna make a big, it's gonna make a difference. And you know, when you look at your tone of your arm, you know, I've got a little look bit of muscle. Look at your bicep. I love you that. are awesome. Look, and you know what? Henry's proud of me. Um, <laughs> Henry and I are gonna box later. No. <laughs> He's gonna win. Um, but it's, it, it, I don't think it's an age thing. I mean, I was not somebody like in high school, a top athlete. I was in the drama club. I was, I didn't do any, I, that yeah. wasn't me. You know, I did, I used to go running, but I never kind of had a regular fitness thing. And I find that as I get older, it's like, if you lose what, for me, what little I had, then you can't, it's like, I remember hurting my back from like just picking up some laundry. Yeah. I always stretch before I work out, which I think is a good idea. Yes. And and I, I stretch and then and I just feel like my circulation's going and I just feel I just feel more energy all the time. And it's also something about um kind of it's almost like happy like a happy pill working out like it's hard I to be so. hard to be sad when I'm working out I don't know why is that Melanie? I can't believe we've never worked together because you're <laughs> saying things that I normally say but we're totally on the same page and you live this this is what's worked for you and that's so totally true exercise is my happy pill too and I see that with a lot of people so with my four kids if I get really grumpy or I have a bad day or I'm feeling depressed they can tell. They're like, mom, did you get your workout in today? Mm -hmm. And sometimes I'll go like lock myself in a room for 20 minutes, get my workout in. And I come back and I'm like, I'm back. Mom's back. I'm happy. I'm good. So there's definitely that part of it where it gives you that emotional it's like boost. like endorphins. I mean, there's like a, yep. isn't it yes. something like there's an actual something? I mean, I'm not like a science guy. Well, but okay. So here's, there's also this, the fact that exercise creates energy, right? So people will say, Sometimes I don't have the energy to work out. I'm tired. I'm too tired to get on the bike. Well, guess what? You get on the bike, you start riding. What am I doing right now? I am creating energy. I'm burning calories, but I'm creating. Mm -hmm. And so you create your own energy. You're the start. You just have to get on. The hardest part is putting on your shoes or mm -hmm. like taking that first step, getting on the bike. But once you're here, you start moving. It's kind of a contagious feeling. Right, and then you know maybe everybody will say, oh, we're gonna go take a hike in the park, and you instead of you being like, oh, go ahead, you'll be uh, like, oh, I'm, I'm on, I'm putting on the little shoes yeah. that I have right next to the bike, and I'm jumping out the door. I mean, I find that I'm less like intimidated really to do anything or try anything. My um, fiance and I went on a cruise, and we, <laughs> We did this thing called zip lining, which it said the level was strenuous. And we were like, I, and I, I thought, well, how strenuous can be? It can't be that strenuous. It was. We literally climbed up a mountain in Mexico, Henry, and went down like 10 zip lines, not one. Wow. And after every zip line, we had to keep climbing up. And I'm not gonna lie, I was like, where's the elevator? Get me out of here. This was a huge mistake. But I did it. I was able to climb every you know mountain and every stair and go through the zip lines, 10 zip lines in the you know, jungles of Mexico and this like crazy kind of thing that 20 year olds were doing. And I think that if I hadn't been on my little X bike every day for a couple of years, I think that there's no way I would have been able to do that. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you really build your fitness. So think of like, if think of fitness as building your foundation and you can, you could, if you had an old house, mm. you could remodel it, right? You could start over. You could like <laughs> tear down the walls and build a new house and, mm. and freshen it up. You can do that with your body, right? You can build a new foundation. You can say, you know what? I'm gonna get moving, I'm gonna eat a little bit healthier. And you can build that new foundation and you get stronger. So just like you were able to do the zip lines and the hikes, 
the fact that you started somewhere and you were consistent and stuck with it, that is what mm. fitness does for your life. It's, right. it's something that it continually gets better. Yeah. And you get stronger. No, I mean, I cannot run a marathon, but I can go on the bike for 30 minutes and I can, I can crank it up. And I will tell you that I feel strong <laughs> enough to do and, you know, kind of fun things yeah. that come my way now. And I think a couple of years ago, I didn't really feel that way. I felt like it was kind of going down a hill. Yeah. And now I'm kind of like climbing up. I'm like getting better and better and better. Yeah. And that's so true. So this could be the start of your fitness journey. You can think of it that way. This can be the start of your fitness journey. You get on the X bike, you start with five minutes, you go a little bit longer or harder every day. And then you might feel, you know what? I'm pretty confident. I want to go try a bar class at the gym or a kickboxing class, or maybe I'm gonna do my first 5K. But it's the start of your fitness journey, and once you become more active, this becomes an essential, what I've been talking about, a balancing mm. tool in your life. So it can fit in with other things you do. If you run, or you like kickboxing, or you like lifting weights, there's always gonna be that rainy day. There's always gonna be that day when you don't wanna go to the gym, or mm. life gets crazy, and you've got this in your home, like, there to back you up. Well, the other thing I wanna talk about is women being by themselves, even if it's a 24 hour gym. So I worked this late night shift for many years and mm -hmm. I joined a 24 hour gym. But on my days off, I did not feel comfortable going to the gym by myself at 3 a.m. I was very comfortable in my home though, getting on my X bike, yep. which was very quiet. So if you're watching us live right now, maybe you're a shift worker, maybe you're a nurse, or you know, there's yep. millions of Americans that are shift workers every day, including my producer, uh, Rob, my director, Prince, and all of us that are here right now. I mean, this isn't the usual nine to five. So maybe your gym isn't open when you feel you've got 15, 20 minutes to work out. But guess what? This gym is always going to be open. It's free shipping and $27.99 for you to take the first very important step and you, I mean, even if you just do it because you want to wear a pair of shorts and have a, you know, go sleeveless in the summer, you know, maybe you, you want to keep up with your grandchildren. Maybe you want to get in back into a dress. I'm getting married actually in October. Oh, um, and congratulations. It's not my first marriage, Henry. It's not. <laughs> Henry knows. And that's my last one. It's my, la it's my last marriage. Uh, but you know, you think, oh, I want to look my best for that. But maybe you don't have some big major thing that you want to look your best for. Feel your best for yourself. Yeah, you just right? want to feel better. Right. Yeah, that's something that I think we all want. You just want to feel better. And there are times, there, if life is a roller coaster, right? So there are times when I don't get my workout done and I don't eat right. But the great thing about fitness is whenever you're ready, what you just said, <coughs> I'm totally stealing that line from you. The gym is always, this gym is always open. Yeah, steal it. I'm stealing that. You from steal her. that. It's That's yours. That's really great. I'm sharing. This gym is always open. It's always open. It's always welcoming. You can come back to it anytime. And it's always safe. You don't need to throw in the towel ever yeah. when you have something like this in your home. But you know what I'm talking about? Like if you're up at 2 a.m., maybe this is your regular schedule. Yeah. Maybe, maybe on your day off, maybe you don't feel like going out to that 24 hour gym, which I've gone to, where it's me and some other person who I think is going to murder me. Like I did not feel comfortable. I felt comfortable in my own house. Guess what? This winter, here's why I liked working out in my own house. Yeah, what One, was winter like in Utah this yes, year? Yes, <laughs> I'm from Utah, but the air was very polluted. We have really bad air where I live, so no one wanted to go outside. And then the other reason why, I used to like to run or ride my bike outside, but I feel like everyone's texting and driving. It's so, uh, whatever. Th those are just my mommy uh, reasons why I like to work out no. at home. I feel safe. Well, that's true. And you know, I'll tell you, here in Florida, there's like a really high pollen count. I, you can hear yeah. me coughing. I have a bit of asthma from childhood. And when the pollen count is up like this, I can't go outside that much. Uh -huh. I, I can't go. I got my little inhaler. I mean, I'm that kid, you yeah. know, but I can... With my air purifiers in my house, I can work out even if the pollen count is high outside. I just found that there was like too many excuses. It's too hot, it's too cold. I don't, blah, yep. blah, blah. I don't, I don't, I don't wanna do my hair and makeup just to work out. There's no excuses now. Uh, you can see how easy it is, how portable it is. The price, by the way, this is one of the lowest prices we've ever, ever done. It's usually $189.95, today it's $139.95. Five flex pay, the most flex pay we've ever done. Free shipping, that's fabulous. We don't always do that. $27.99. We're gonna take a listen to Kate, one of our last testimonials that we have on tape, and, and listen to her experience with our Proform X bike. 
My name is Kate and I am a mother of four. I like using the X-Bike because I was able to incorporate it into my daily life. I have a toddler and I need to be home with her and that's something that I can do when she's right there with me. My favorite feature of the X-Bike is probably the portability, that I can move it around and move it to where I need to be and it's very stable still to be able to move it around and still have it be able to be stable for me. This is not my final destination. I plan to continue and to become stronger and more fit and to become a better me than I am today. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Henry, Henry has known me for years here at HSN and I, I, did, I did have other things. I had other fitness equipment that were, I moved and I had a big treadmill and it was so big that I didn't move with me. Yep. This is very portable. In the house that I live in now, um, this, I have this and I have a, um, oh gosh, I can't remember the name, you know, the thing where you do the sit-ups on it that's on the floor. You know what I'm talking about? I can't remember the name of it right now because I can't remember anything. But, um, and, the, and, the, and the pro form, this is what I have in my living room. This is what I do every day. And it's easy to do something every day. It's not like, oh, it's a chore, I gotta do this. It's so do you keep it out or do you fold it up and put it away? Do you just I, leave it out? I never fold it. Mm -hmm. I keep it like that and I, and I pick it up. Mm -hmm. And I'll show you, I'll, you guys can watch me pick it up. I pick it up and I move it next to the TV set. Mm -hmm. And then, so it's, the, the living room's open. And uh -huh. then when I'm, it's time to work out, you I pick it, it up the... and I put it next, uh, in front of the TV set. And then I have a fireplace with a mantle and I uh -huh. use that almost like a shelf. And I put like a big bottle of water. The other thing is, I'm not great about drinking water. I know we're supposed to drink water every day. Yes. So I fill up a thing with water and then I give myself the 30 minutes on the bike to complete the water. So. And I'm doing like three things. I'm doing my arm exercises, I'm getting my water in, and I'm doing 30 minutes of cardio. So I try to, you know, kind of put it together like I've... Guess what you're doing? You're combining healthy behaviors. So sometimes you just need that one healthy beha behavior in your life. You make that one change, you bring the bike into your home, and then it invites other healthy behaviors. Then you're like, oh yeah, I need water. Yeah. I should probably eat more fiber. Right. I should call my mom. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah. it kind of invites other healthy behaviors. Right. Yeah. 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 And um, my parents live in London, so I email them. But <laughs> <laughs> it's expensive to call them. But yeah, I mean, it. I just, I just really love it. And you know, I really feel super confident that you guys will love this piece of equipment. And if you are somebody who exercises all the time, you'll love it. And if you go to the gym three days a week and do a big, big weightlifting routine and you just want to do your cardio at home, I know some people that are real fitness people. One of our guests here at HSN is a good friend of mine, Tim Wilkins, is, is like really into bodybuilding stuff, but you still got to do your like cardio. He, he does that every day. A lot of super fitness people do their cardio at home. Home. Um, or if you're like me and you're somebody that like this is pretty much all you do, I, I, I tell you, but it's enough. It really is. It's enough. And it also, like you said, spurns on other things. Like on your day off, maybe you'll go kayaking or hiking or zip lining or do some other fun thing. Yeah. And the next thing you know, you're living that kind of a lifestyle as opposed to it's more, more of a sedentary lifestyle, yeah. non participatory. Like right. everybody does all the fun things, you're hiding the background. Right. It, it, so it really gives you that confidence you need, that confidence boost, and just improves your strength and overall, overall cardio, your overall help, so that you can do those activities with your family and feel confident about it and really enjoy that physical activity because that's be what we all need. I don't care who you are, what age you are, um, gender, size, it does not matter. We all have to move our bodies and we all feel better when we do that. You know, I, I, I think that obviously check with your doctor before you start any kind of fitness regimen. Yep. I mean, everybody's different. So, you know, make sure you take care of yourself and check, check in with your, your own doctor about this. But it's, it's just so convenient. It's so easy. And it's not, 
and it's not something that is not comfortable. I mean, if you sit down and watch TV, you can just sit on this. You can have it on the easiest, the lightest setting. Right. Where you're just moving your feet around and circles. You're already, you're already circulate. You're already getting your circulation going. Yeah. You know? Yeah, you just sit and you move your feet. When you feel more confident, you can pick up the weights or add some resistance. Or this comes with those two DVDs. I've been here a few times where I get to present this Proform bike. It doesn't always have DVDs. So you've got four workout DVDs with a trainer, with me, uh, to help you learn how to use this bike, get more out of it, or just motivate you when you need that extra motivation. But this bike is also there if you just want to get on and ride. Five minutes, anything is better than nothing. And especially when it feels good and it helps you feel more confident about yourself, that is a win-win. That's like a what are you waiting for type of mm -hmm. opportunity because it's got everything you need. Everything that you need. And the weights, and I will say, like if they're two pound weights and there's lots of exercises you can do. The mats, by the way, are also available, uh, Rob. I know we have some available. I think the, the black actually is really, really limited, uh, but we also have them available in clear, 086895. Um, I think they're $34.95, $36.45, I was guessing. So $36 and change. So I just wanted to mention that, that sometimes people see that and say, oh, where do I get the mat? We've got them here. We can send them to you. Uh, you can order those as well uh, and in the last like minute what would you say to somebody who's like oh, I don't know I'm afraid if I get it home I won't use it what would you say to that person it, I if you're not if you're worried that you won't use it you will use it just get it in your home put it together and sit on the bike and start pedaling tell yourself that you are worth trying this for five minutes get on pedal just see how you feel because what happens is it starts to feel good. It starts to feel like, yep, this is something my body needs and you'll go a little bit longer and this is something that will add value to your life. Think about all the times you might sit in your car and you drive for 30 minutes somewhere. What if that <coughs> drive time, that 30 minutes in your day, you were just changing your chair mm -hmm. and you were riding a bike? Well, Melanie, uh, you know, the, all, all those are